Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you've read the title of this video, you already know what's happening, but I'm getting my wisdom teeth taken out. So it's actually happening tomorrow and I'm just getting ready for work now and I'm expecting a call from the hospital today just to talk about like fasting and like what time my surgery is and stuff. But they've got to take all four out. So all four of them have to come out. So yeah i'm not really excited about the after pain but <laughs> i'm excited to be able to have no pain in general and to be able to eat on both sides of my mouth so i'm just packing now and i thought i would show you what i'm going to put in my bag and just bring you along i'm going to be staying with cam for a few days the um hospital is actually closer to him so and i don't have access to a freezer or like a proper fridge where I could set jelly or have ice packs and stuff. So, and whilst that's its own issue, <laughs> I am not going to get upset about it. But I have my stuff here and I went and bought myself, um, oh sorry that lighting's a bit ordinary. I went and bought myself some potatoes as well to have mashed potatoes. So I've got some potatoes here and some glass bowls. For the jelly I think what I might do is even just put the plastic bag in there as like a buffer so in here I've got like all different flavors of jelly and then some ice packs so I'm gonna take that with me and I might just put that in here too I expect that I won't be able to like talk much or do much really so I'm gonna take um, my word search book <laughs> and I did buy this book the other day as well um, it's super popular it ends with us by Colleen Hoover so I'm gonna continue reading that and I'm gonna take my laptop and I think I should be good I do have some editing to do and some catching up to do but other than that, I think I'll just be recovering. It will be a bit boring and I do I do have a few days off work just to make sure that I'm like fully recovered. I'm gonna take my own pillow. That's what I'm gonna do. Hello, good morning. I am at Cameron's house. Um getting ready. So the surgery is today. Um, so Cameron actually moved to like the next town over which is actually where my surgery is happening So I'm just gonna be staying with him for like the next few days. So I came to Cameron's last night and we had um, Mexican for dinner, so I was actually allowed to have dinner. I didn't think I was. I thought I was going only gonna be allowed to have lunch You know when you can't talk when you do this stuff? And then we watched Gogglebox, which is like my favorite show and and now I'm just getting ready. I did distract my hair this morning because I thought it might be easier to tie up and whatnot. So there's no like, like loose strands or frizzy bits. I'm not allowed to have any water or anything now until afterwards. I would just use the bathroom, but Cameron's in there, so I don't really want to disturb him. But we made jelly last night, so having that. And I brought myself some yogurt, so we'll have a little bit of something. So I've just gotten ready this morning. I had to do a little test and it has come back negative. So that's all good. Stop. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> so now we are just getting ready to go. I was going to go for a walk this morning, but I didn't get time. You wake up in time. Oh, I wonder if it's set yet. This is the one we have. Oh, it's set. Creaming soda and lime. <laughs> <You're late. laughs> so yeah, other than that, pretty much ready to go. Cameron said to me this morning that I shouldn't bother about brushing the four teeth they're gonna take out. <laughs> And I was like, I wasn't sure whether to brush my teeth or not to like worry about it. But I was like, oh, like I just, it's like routine. I'll just do it anyway. Are you almost good to go, Cam? 
Anyways, good to go? Yeah, I'll just make the bed. Do you want a hand? Oh, I want to say no. Girlfriend of the year. <laughs> <laughs> And that is how it's done. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> So it's been a couple of hours. Um, this is so warm, so I can't feel my mouth. <laughs> um, just had a breath. It's so jolly. So yeah, this is day one. So I'll keep you updated, but yeah, it's really hard to walk. I just can't feel this part of my mouth on my tongue and they said that tomorrow and Saturday would be the worst day so I'm just a bit tired and a little bit sore um, so just resting and just on the couch um, but I'm not really supposed to be talking, but yeah, this is day one. I'll keep you up to here. Um, hello, it's actually a few days later now and I'm back home. I had every intention of picking up my camera and videoing, but I genuinely was just in so much pain and was like so tired. So it's still like hard to talk. I did get a couple of clips. I'm not really sure what I got. My face was quite bloated. Um, and it's still so sore, like particularly on this side, like it hurts to like smile and like talk for like a long amount of time. And I hate not smiling and just not eating like, oh. Like today was like the first day. It's like what? It's not gonna focus. Okay, it's three o'clock now. And I'm gonna have like a little bit of dinner, but all I've had today is like some yogurt and noodles, which is like the most I can do. But it's like, it's just so sore. It was a whole experience. Like I got there and I was pretty much like straight in. Like I just signed a couple of things and they gave me my pack of goodies, which has like paracetamol, ibuprofen, and like my script medication, so I didn't have to go out and get it myself, and like instructions and a vomit bag and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, like the the whole thing was really quick. It only took about two and a half hours. I'm going back to work tomorrow, so I wanted to make sure that I was like not going to be sleepy and get a good night's rest. I don't know. Do I? I don't know if I look puffy. Like more on this side is where it hurts. I couldn't get a spoon in my mouth because all of like my whole mouth was like numb. I couldn't feel it, so I couldn't feed myself. I do have a photo. This is me because I can't feel where it's coming. So yeah, that's me trying to. This was me at the hospital, just feeling great. So I was like in super high spirits beforehand, and then after, just like in so much pain, like genuinely. And on the second day after, I also got my period, so 
I feel like this always happens to me and Cameron is always saying this. He's like, you always get it when we're going somewhere or something important is happening. And I'm like, oh, it's just not my luck. So, but because I was on like medication and stuff, like pain relief anyway for this, it won't, didn't really matter. Like I was sitting in bed anyway, but no, Cameron was so good. Like he literally just got me ice cream and ice packs, like whenever I needed it. Like literally I was like, I would like, make the slightest complaint he'd just like run and get an ice pack or something like that <sighs> so grateful i'm talking a lot more now which is great but it was like there was a few tears i'll be honest like i think it was just overwhelming and frustrating like not being able to eat and just like <sighs> taking so long to eat too and i was like i'm just so over this we survived overall it was a pretty positive experience if you have to get your wisdom teeth taken out just make sure you have like a really good support system because i probably would have been in like a lot more pain if it wasn't for like cameron and the doctors and stuff but i hope to get this video up soon my hard drive has actually crashed so that's why there hasn't been a video up for a little bit there's been nothing going on literally it's just i've lost everything on my hard drive including like all my youtube stuff and I was in the middle of editing another video and it's all gone. I might, if I want to get it back, I have to pay all this money and I just don't know if it's worth it, but I'm going to try and rebuild my iMovie and editing and all that to get, get it back to how it was. Um, there was some clips that I had saved um, for a video later on in the year, um, but that's all gone, unfortunately, so I'm a little bit sad. <sighs> It's okay, everything happens. There's nothing you can do. I hope you enjoyed this video, a little bit of my wisdom teeth journey and the photos that I showed. And I will see you all in my next video very, very soon. Bye.